hey what up decisive marketers so today we have a landing page builder to be talking about it has multi pages as well able to accept payments uh, has Zapier integration has WordPress integration uh, it sounds fantastic right and uh, I like that it's very simple to use and of course it's fast right because this tool itself is called fast pages but before I dive into fast pages be sure to hit that subscribe button if you like to see more digital marketing and e-commerce content so here we are in fast pages um, let me just jump back into the dashboard right here so you can see that the uh, this page that I have published on fast pages it loads in um, half a second right so half a second all right uh, so that's really fast uh, that's for the uh, largest contentful uh, contentful pain of course it's not the fully loaded time it takes about 2.1 second for the for it to be fully loaded okay so uh so there of course there is some uh you know uh some e some issues that could be improved on uh let's see right so let's click on structure this is the G gt metric score right? so okay so we've got images and these uh this image itself is not properly sized so you, of course you can use a uh, image optimizer to improve it okay and then uh, s some not really sure what this is I don't think this these ones can be served from CDN um, otherwise I think it's fine right uh, if, I mean it's like a 0 0.05 seconds uh, server response time so uh, and it works on JPEG so no WebP otherwise it could be even faster uh, but you know this is already very very fast already very very fast just look at the performance score and the uh, structure right so uh, we're going to jump into projects right here okay sorry let me just go into settings so you can connect your stripe account and you can connect multiple accounts you can see that you know it's connected account zero right so it, you know you can connect multiple uh, stripe account okay let me just jump back in to fast pages and then you've got your wordpress plugin so you can install wordpress and have fast pages load uh, some of your pages as static so that's amazing right okay and then uh, you have uh, you can set your language for the entire application they have English and Dutch and then the Zapier API key right here and uh, you can have uh, Facebook conversion API integrated into fast pages right here okay so uh, so that that is also one big thing that they have Facebook conversion API okay so that will happen when you have a form submission or a payment uh, feature right so I'm gonna click on edit right here so you can see it loads in the editor very very fast okay so this would be the landing page that I have it's I think uh, like a webinar landing page okay so you know this okay so let me just jump back in here so uh, pages so if you click on pages you can see that you can add multiple pages right here so this is great uh, because you can create multiple pages and basically create a website just from fast pages itself okay all right so uh, that's the multi page uh, feature and of course you can have a home page and then a thanks thank you page uh, and then your sections are right here you can you know easy easily navigate them or move them around uh, SEO options you got your page title uh, your meta keywords your page description favicon uh, open graph images you can all set them up right here okay so there is no open graph uh, description so you can't separate your meta description with your open graph description and title so you know it's gonna take the uh, m you know meta title and uh, meta description into your open graph uh, description and title okay so there's no separation over there you can set up pop-ups as well okay so you can set up pop-ups as well so 
uh, you can have the pop up, you know, trigger right here. So this is the uh, pop up. Let me just close this right here. So that's the pop up menu. And you can also set the appearances for the entire site, right? So the typography for the headings, the paragraphs, uh, the general color, the menu text color, right? Your menu text hover color and enable RTL. So I'm not really sure what this is. Sorry, this is right to left. Okay, so this is right to left. So if you are using a language that is read from right to left then you use that feature right there okay and this is where you insert your facebook pixel and your facebook conversion api access token right here so what happens is that whenever there is a form submission whenever there is a uh, payment it is going to uh, send a uh, you will send a event via Facebook conversion API right so if you're running ads and stuff like that it's going to make your ads much uh, you know your tracking much more accurate okay and you can insert uh, header body and footer codes as well okay uh, header sorry header and body codes I would say right so uh, right here okay so this is the beginning of the body this is the end of the body and all your revisions are right here okay and this is to return to the dashboard right so um i you can edit them based on the uh, entire section so this is the columns and uh, rows that you can you know edit based on the uh the section itself and then uh if you want to uh, enable mobile optimization so let's see okay so you can actually optimize it for mobile as well okay and uh, the background image you know you can have it as a full width or not okay, padding and stuff like that okay every element itself Let's see some of the options, right? So background, okay, very simple stuff, right? Spacing, so uh, spacing between elements. So this one is more like padding, right? So they don't have uh, uh, what do you call that? It's it's just like paddings itself. Okay, let's look at the button, right? You can insert icons as well, I think. So you can insert icons into the button. I'm not really sure why it's not showing up. Okay, there we go, right? So I think it took a while to load. but now it converts everything into the button itself how do we remove icons okay i think the icon is too large and it's causing this issue okay so maybe let's jump back with the revision
Okay, so we can see the icon is right here, right? So I think it takes a while for the editor to reflect the changes. Okay, and this is the form. Okay, so we can see the form right here. We can edit them based on fills. Okay, so let me just uh, click here and see what are the elements that we can add right we can have text we can have images we can have buttons we can have spaces we can have lines or separators right icons icon text uh, countdown as well so this is great because uh, not many uh, landing page uh, builders do have countdowns you can insert videos forms uh, you can embed an element in there you can have quiz as well Alright, so let's try quiz. Not really sure how it works. Okay. And then you can create more questions as well. And you can create logics. Let's see. So you can create the conditional logic, right? So if they score certain points, you're going to lead them somewhere. Uh, if they score certain points, you're going to lead them somewhere else. And then you can have a lead form to capture that information as well so this is very nice i would say okay so i guess once you're done just close it right and then you should load up uh, in the landing page itself okay and then you have menu and you have payment right so the payment would be for you to connect with your stripe account right so you got to connect your stripe account in here uh i think you know, I think this is very nice because fast pages seems to allow you to build pages very very quickly. And you can build an entire site with this because you can use uh, multi pages. Uh, they have multi pages features within fast pages itself. Uh, and I think for the price that this is going for is I think is very uh, affordable because the they do have limits on fast pages because i think the lowest plans gives you 50000 uh visits per month right so 50000 limits per month i think that's maybe about like 10000 visitors per month which is quite little for a sizable uh, as in like a you know a web a, a small little website that's growing somewhere so that's the only thing to take note of uh, so I guess that's all I have to share I think the biggest plus would be like the uh, WordPress feature so that maybe certain pages that you don't need uh, you don't really need it you can use fast pages uh, as a landing page you have a static page you can just convert it using fast pages so I think that's the biggest uh, value of fast pages right here the downside is that there's no api no web hooks at all so you got to use zapier uh, and of course elements wise they are missing there's no tabs there's no accordions so you know i think accordions are very important especially if you want to add uh, faq right frequently asked questions in your landing page itself so otherwise i guess that's all i have to share i think overall it is a very promising tool uh, although i heard that you know you know uh, the tool does take some time to update every now and then so that's all i have to share about fast pages if you enjoyed this video do give me a thumbs up if you know anyone who could benefit from a landing page builder with multi-page features built in 
uh, Facebook conversion API built in. Be sure to share this video with them. And lastly, let me know what you think about fast pages in the comments below. I'll see you in my next video. Bye bye.